is the father of a daughter, the only thing that we really want is for her to find somebody that will love her and care for her the way that we do as dads. And whether that's at 15 or 50, does it really matter? No. Everybody always asks me, she's getting married young. Are you worried about that? And I will tell you right now, because of that young man, I don't worry at all. <laughs> I'm gonna get you. I cannot believe we're already here. I'm like freaking I know. out. I was looking at the clock. I'm like, oh my gosh, it's like in an hour. Yeah. Like, what just happened? <laughs> Day has actually come. It feels like forever. You guys are so fun to be around and I wish you nothing but the best. I'm excited to see where this next chapter of life takes the both of you. When you go through difficulties, may you allow them to bring you together. I know better than you know most just how crazy these two are about it, about each other. When you want to hold a grudge, may you choose to hold each other's hand instead. We all have our own remember when moments with the bride and groom. Whether it's the day they were born, maybe a birthday, maybe life group or youth group, maybe it was graduating high school. After today, all of us will have a new remember when moment with both Brayden and Caitlin. Remember when they tied the knot. And I wonder what it's like to get to hold them every night. This is going to be hard. Brayden, it's finally here. We've been praying and planning our lives together for the past three and a half years, and today is the day that we start a new chapter as man and wife. 1,277, I think that wasn't it, days, <laughs> we've been together. And while that may sound high to some people, it will never be enough to me. I cannot imagine one day before you, and now I'll never have to imagine a day without you. Caitlin, I'm so excited to spend today laughing, crying, and celebrating forever with you, my love. Today marks three years, six months, and 24 days since I've got to call you mine, and has truly been an amazing ride full of love, joy, trials, and anticipation to get to where we are standing today. <laughs> I'm so happy for you both, so proud of where you're at right now, and so excited to see you progress. Oh wow, very beautiful. Very beautiful. How are we doing? I'm doing good. Good? Yeah. So are we ready to do this? I am, yes. Right, next. Right. Oh jeez. gives this bride to be with her groom? Her mother and I. I'd like to begin by welcoming and thanking everyone for being here to celebrate an occasion that I know is not only monumental for Brayden and Caitlin, but for all of us who know and love them as individuals and who sh share the joy of their relationship. Will you, with your family and friends, as witnesses, Present yourselves willingly and of your one own accord to be joined in marriage. Amen. Amazing. Now, Brayden and Caitlin, may your life together be immersed in love, joy. May you strive to enrich each other in every possible way. And may your love be a representation of God's unending love for us. Having pledged their fidelity to one another, to love, honor, and cherish one another in the presence of God in this gathering of family and friends and by the authority vested in me 
by the amazing state of Ohio. It is my honor to pronounce you husband and wife. Brayden, you may kiss your bride. My speech is going to be like a mini skirt, long enough to cover the essentials and short enough to hold your attention. Yeah. Brayden, I want to thank you for being such a stable force in my life, a great friend and an even better brother. Caitlin, I think we can all agree that you are stunning this evening and that Brayden won the lottery. We all wish you a lifetime of happiness, love, health, success, and laughter. May your friendship continue to grow throughout all the years to come. Cheers. Someone that I'm